Hello. In this video, we're going to teach you how to use segments in Drip, explain why segments give you more power than a traditional list, and most importantly, let you know how segmenting your list increases customer engagement and sales. In Drip, instead of using lists to store and manage your customers, you'll use segments. Segments are smaller groups of people pulled from your main list. They allow you to make groups of people who have things in common, such as email engagement, purchase history, or purchase frequency. Segments pack more power than a traditional list because they're dynamic instead of static. This means that if the criteria defined by the segment is added or removed from someone, the segment will automatically update and that person will be added or removed from it accordingly. Unlike lists, which stay the same unless you make tedious manual changes, and nobody has time for that. For example, in the Drip Apparel store, we have a saved segment for non-purchasers and another saved segment for one-time purchasers. As soon as someone makes their first purchase, they are automatically removed from the non-purchaser segment and added to the one-time purchaser segment. Dynamic segments ensure that when we create lists of people to send an email, we don't send irrelevant information to people on those lists. At Drip, we believe that the key to success is sending the right message to the right person at the right time. Using segments to effectively target your customers can increase conversions, generate higher revenue per person, lower your unsubscribe rate, build up more brand affinity, and so much more. Manage your lists on the people page in Drip. Here is where you can see the total number of active people in your account. Add new people, search for existing customers, create and save segments, and manage your data with tags and custom fields. Use the filter at the top of this page to view and group people by shared behaviors, like purchase history, website activity, email engagement, and more. Once you create and save at least one segment, you can view recently edited segments on the left-hand side of the people page. We'll automatically populate a segment called Everyone, which includes all active people in your account. Take a minute to explore the criteria available to build your segments. There are a lot of options in Drip, and just perusing your options can be a big inspiration for your next strategy. You'll use the filter on this page to create and save a segment. Now, let's walk through how to create a segment of your best customers, or customers who are the most loyal. Select Purchase History from the drop-down menu, and filter by Has Placed an Order, At Least Three Times, Over All Time, On Any Product, At Any Price, In Any Quantity. Click and add the criteria lifetime value is greater than or equal to 200. The lifetime value will be different depending on the products that you offer. For example, none of our products in the Drip Apparel store are over $50. So if someone spent over $200 with us over three plus purchases, that means they're spending a good chunk of money with us. Use this logic when deciding on a lifetime value number for your segment. Save the segment and name it best customers. From there, you'll be redirected to a page that shows a preview of the first 25 people who are now in the segment. Boom, you just created your first segment in Drip. From here on out, anyone who places more than three orders and has a lifetime value greater than the number you decided on will be added to this segment. In addition to helping you get to know your customers, Drip provides your store with actionable customer data. Click on an individual customer's email address to view their whole profile. Here you can find important data such as contact information, details about their orders, their website, and email engagement history. You'll also have access to a chronological activity timeline of their interactions with your brand, which gives you a better understanding of the customer journey across channels. For example, from Alex's profile, we can see that he's ordered quite a few hats and sweatshirts and his lifetime value is over $200. This tells us that he's one of our most loyal customers and we wanna reach out to him and say thank you. Our best customers segment tells us that there are other people on our list like Alex who are super loyal and love our brand. This gives us an opportunity to reach out and grow our relationship with these customers. You can use the data found in the profile section to create different segments and build emails tailored for each. Remember, the goal is to ensure that people are getting information that's the most relevant to them. Yes, you just learned how to build your first segment in Drip. Segmentation is a powerful tool, and it's also a crucial one that empowers you to send highly relevant and personalized content to your customers to increase engagement, sales, and loyalty.